This is a step-by-step -step guide for replacing the control board on your Mr. Cool Mini Split Air Handler. Before starting, make sure the power is turned off to the handler. Then, open the front cover and remove the filters. Next, you'll remove the electrical panel cover and disconnect power to the display. And then, unscrew the mounting screws for the exterior cover of the handler. Removing the louver makes the whole process easier, but is not totally necessary. You can unlatch from the middle as our head tech does here, and the rest should come easily. There is a screw underneath the cap that sits underneath the louver. Depending on the size of the system, there may be two additional screws, one on each side. Examine your handler, and they should be easy to see. You'll unscrew them next. Then unlatch the back clips and the front cover is ready to be detached. Next, you'll unscrew the grounding wires seen here. There are two, and then you'll cut the zip tie that secures them onto the copper tubing. Make sure and be careful. Then you'll unplug the pipe temperature sensor from its port. Now you'll unscrew the electrical hookups and the ground wire. And then you'll take off the cover for the blower motor plug and the stepper motor. The two hookups are secured with a plastic red brace. That needs to be taken off with a small screwdriver or a knife, as our head tech does here. Be careful and make sure not to damage any wiring. Next, you'll unscrew the control board's fixing screw, and then pull up on the clip and pull the control board off of the handler. Now it's time to install the new control board. You'll align the clip shown here with its corresponding part on the handler, just like our head tech does here. And then it's time to reassemble the system starting with the mounting screw. Next, reattach the blower motor plug and the stepper motor plug and reattach their cover. Then secure the electrical wires to their component ports. And then reattach the grounding wires above the coils and secure them via zip tie to the coil as it was before. Cut any additional zip tie slack. Now replace the pipe temperature sensor. And then place the handler's cover back over top. It's best to start at the bottom and push the top over before snapping into place. Then you'll reattach the display's power and put the electric panel cover back on. Now you'll re-screw the screw into the port below where the louver usually sits. Again, depending on the size, there can be more than the one shown here. Then re-screw into the front panel of the handler and replace the louver. Be careful not to harm the louver when maneuvering it into place. Then you'll re-put the filters in, close the lid, and your system is good to go. If you have any further issues, please contact Mr. Cool's support team. Mr. Cool, comfort made simple.